Hi everybody, today's focus, I am testing Clorox compostable wipes to see how well they remove bacteria in my home. Today's video is a viewer request. I received an email from Amita who explained that her son actually really likes my channel and he's curious if these Clorox compostable wipes do as well as the regular Clorox wipes. So today, Amita, this video is for you and your son. I'm really glad that Amita reached out to me because I did not know that Clorox made compostable wipes. So in order to test how well they remove bacteria around my home, what I'm gonna do is take a petri dish just like this guy here and label it A, B, and C. I'm gonna take some sterile swabs and swab various areas around my home, like my kitchen sink, kitchen sink drain, bathroom sink, and toilet rim. I'll place that sample in the section labeled B for before. Then I'll clean according to the wipes directions, swab the area again, and place that sample in the section labeled A for after. This way we'll be able to see how much bacteria is on a surface before and after cleaning with these Clorox compostable wipes. Let's read what's on the packaging and how we're supposed to use them. So on the front here it says Clorox compostable cleaning wipes, free and clear, safe around kids, pets, and food, formulated without dyes, bleach, or ammonia. Fragrance free. They did have 11 cent also, but I chose to go with the fragrance free. On the side here, it does say they're a safer choice through the EPA. Then on the back, they have basically the same information on the top here. It does have an asterisk about the home composting. It says, do not compost wipes if used to clean non-compostable messes, such as human or animal waste. Wipes should generally be no more than 10% of total home compost pile. Okay, that's good. To learn more and for detailed home composting instructions, yes please, visit clorox.com slash compostable. Let's do that now. Let's go check out their website. Okay, so we go to www.clorox.com slash compostable. Okay, well, that website doesn't exist. Okay, we'll just search for the product and try to find more information. Compost. Ah, here they are. Okay, here they are, the free and clear compostable wipes. I'm gonna scroll really fast to see if I can find any extra information. So I'm not finding any detailed home composting instructions on their website. Maybe I'm missing something. I can look again later. Now I have a wrinkle indoor electric composter and I've made videos about that here. I can link that in the description below if you wanna see them. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try composting maybe two or three of these or one or two of these. I don't know yet how many in my wrinkle composter. Now what I will do to test how well it can be composted is I'm going to take a clean wipe and I'm gonna rinse it with water to remove any of the cleaning agents that are in the wipe because I do not want any of my healthy bacteria that's in my compost pile to decrease. I don't want these wipes to remove any of that bacteria or kill any of that bacteria. Actually, let's have a look at the active ingredients so we can see what we're talking about here. Um, let's see, oh, ethanol. All right, so that's probably it there, isopropanol. All right, sodium hydroxide, okay, citric acid. All right, okay. So I don't want those things to remove the bacteria in my compost pile, so I am gonna rinse them first before I put them in the pile. Okay, but I'll show you all that. You know something interesting on this packaging is I'm actually not seeing anywhere on these wipes any claims to be able to remove bacteria. It's funny, I just assumed it because most Clorox products have the big, you know, removes 99% bacteria all over it, but this actually has no claims on it at all. So I'll swab the areas before cleaning and then we'll clean according to these directions. And what are the directions? Pull out a wipe from the center. To clean, wipe the surface with Clorox compostable wipes free and clear. Let air dry. For highly soiled surfaces, clean excess dirt first. Clorox compostable wipes free and clear will not harm most surfaces, including acrylic, fiberglass, and vinyl. Not recommended for use in unpainted wood. No rinse required for food contact surfaces. Okay, so it does not have a sit time like it must remain wet for a certain amount of time to remove bacteria because they don't have any claims on here that it can remove bacteria. So this is just wipe and air dry. 
So the time for drying is probably going to vary according to the surface that I'm using it on. I will just make sure that the area is completely dry before testing for the after sample. So let's see how well these Clorox compostable cleaning wipes and free and clear fragrance free remove bacteria from my home even though they make no claims to be able to do so. Now for some results. The kitchen sink. In the before section, we can see some bacteria. It's not a tremendous amount. We definitely can see some bacteria. And in the after section, there's no bacterial growth at all. So the Clorox compostable cleaning wipes did a great job of removing the bacteria from my kitchen sink. The kitchen sink drain. In the before section, we can see a lot of bacteria. And in the after section, there's no bacterial growth at all. So the Clorox compostable cleaning wipes did an excellent job removing the bacteria from my kitchen sink drain. The bathroom sink. In the before section, there is a tremendous amount of bacteria. And in the after section, there's no bacterial growth at all. So the Clorox compostable cleaning wipes did an excellent job removing the bacteria from my bathroom sink. The toilet rim. In the before section, we can see a lot of bacteria and different types too. And in the after section, there's no bacterial growth at all. So the Clorox compostable cleaning wipes did an excellent job of removing the bacteria from my toilet rim. I also tested the wipe's ability to be broken down in my wrinkle indoor composter. And 24 hours later, I was unable to find any trace at all of the wipe. So they did a great job at breaking down in my compost. Overall, these Clorox compostable cleaning wipes did an excellent job of removing bacteria around my home, even though they do not make any claims to be able to do so. I did purchase the fragrance free scent, so I didn't have any perfumey scent at all while I was cleaning. However, there is a bit of a, I don't know, almost soapy smell to them. Uh, nothing strong at all. I only detect it when I smell like inside the container. When each individual wipe was out, I didn't smell anything at all. The wipes have a good feeling to them and they are rather strong.
but they are made of materials that allow them to be broken down in my indoor composter. I think it's important to note that before I put the wipe inside my wrinkle indoor composter, I did rinse off any cleaners that I could. I didn't want to put a wipe that had cleaning products inside my wrinkle composter because I want bacterial growth in my composting system. So I did rinse the wipes to try to remove any of the cleaning product that was on there. So thank you, Amita, for asking me to test these Clorox compostable cleaning wipes. I think they did a great job. If there is a product that you want me to test, do me a favor and put it in the comment section and I will add it to my viewer suggestion list or you can mail me something. My email address is in the description below. Send me an email. Let's have a conversation about the product that you would like me to test. It could be something I've already tested or something that I have in queue at home. And I'd like to tell you my timeline where I am in creating videos. Then I'll provide to you my mailbox address. I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care. Have yourselves a great day. <music>